Hey, uh, we're the Men in White Coats. I'm Michael. I'm Stephen. And we're going to be playing some survival for you. Yeah. Yeah, this is a uh, plain old vanilla. We're playing in the snapshot currently. Ouch. Uh, 14 week 20B. Yep. So we're going to get to play with those sticky blocks, which is going to be great fun. Slime blocks. Woo. Uh, but it might be a little while away from now because we're not particularly fast. Um, we've decided that we're going to build lots of different buildings and have sort of like a compound thing is the plan that again may be quite a long way away <laughs> yeah <laughs> we'll get there so as normal you always start out by punching wood Whee! oh you've got probably, taken inventory. probably should uh, actually go for all the achievements I always like miss out the taking inventory achievement and then I miss out on the wood one because I've already picked up all my wood before I open my inventory. <laughs> Always works out that way. So how have you been? It's been ages since we've been on YouTube. It has been ages. <laughs> we've both been so ridiculously busy. Yep. It's just Oh those those university days are over. I know, shame. when they were such an easy life. <laughs> <laughs> We both have to work so hard now. It makes life so much more boring. It really does. Especially with your job. At well, least mine yeah, does. I have a little bit of interest. Something's different each day. Yeah. If only I had got a job in what I had wanted to do with my degree. I know. One day it'll come round, no doubt. Yeah, either that or I'll just go back to uni and become an eternal student. <laughs> I can see you being an eternal student. I probably wouldn't mind that. Apart from exam time. <laughs> Living off of your microwave burgers and your cookie crisp. Here, I am not that person anymore. Not anymore, I know, but you were when it was exam <laughs> time. <laughs> it was really funny. Oh. So yeah, lots has changed since we were last recording. Yeah, definitely. We've all uh, had a big change. Left university life behind us. Started the world of work. Oh yeah, the joyous world of work. It's terrible, don't do it kids. <laughs> like one of those public service announcements. Yeah. <laughs> Avoid work at all costs. It's pretty sound uh, no, advice. Pretty accurate advice, I would admit. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going for about a stack of wood and then we'll go underground? Uh, sure. Or do you want to build the houses and then go underground? Um, I don't really mind. Um, I, we need to find food before we go under anyway. This is true. There's quite a lot of cows and pigs and I found chickens. Well, that would be a good start. Yeah. I mean, there's plenty of these trees here anyway, so we're not really going to need to plant any more just now. No, that's very true. There's there's a good supply. And we've also got the mushrooms, so we could use them to get mushroom stews on the go. Mm -hmm. I found a red mushroom around the corner here. Right, okay. So we could always do that. Yep. Quite a good early game food, mushroom stew. Got my crafting bench. Oh, you beat me to it. So, something else new for this first time recording in ages. We are actually going to be recording both perspectives. Yeah, I got a better computer. <laughs> so Michael's computer Marginal. doesn't threaten to die every 10 seconds. And can yeah. actually now do a recording. So, we're going to try and use his as well as mine. So you don't have to put up with just me sitting punching wood. You can <laughs> see what Michael's up to as well. I'm not promising it's going to be great. Um, I think there's a few RAM issues with the computer, but you know, <laughs> nothing's yeah. perfect. Nothing's perfect. No, precisely. <laughs> um, and there's a random bat that has just appeared from nowhere. Ooh. I'm not really sure what it's doing. Is there a cave down here? That means there must be a cave around somewhere. Oh, there is a. Oh, it's not really a cave. 
It's pretending to be a cave, is it? It's kind of pretend. Yeah, it's kind of pretending to be a cave. <laughs> it's where the bats are coming from, though. Oh. Oh, it is a cave. It's the bat cave. Um, and there's some iron down here, so I'm gonna collect that. That's a good start. Because the sooner we get going, the better. I just keep punching wood. You got my upgrade. You got your upgrade. I know that I have this wooden, this uh, stone pick. The wooden one will never be touched again. Um, this is mostly so to annoy that them. day that they introduced it as. Uh, as a fuel source. Yeah, because it was the <laughs> only time Michael's ever used a wooden pickaxe after he's got his three stone. Yeah, I genuinely just don't use them. <laughs> <laughs> and this has been since they introduced wooden pickaxes all that time ago. Yep. As soon as I can have a stone one, I have a stone one. The wooden one is useless afterwards. And it would sit in a chest, just annoying me the whole yep. time. <laughs> And that had been the case since when we first started playing, which was a very long time ago now. That was oh that was probably still in today. Yeah it was. Well I've got my sword. Oh I've got a stack and a bit of wood. Um uh, I need to have coal though, because I have no coal at the moment. <laughs> Uh, which whereabouts is the cave you've gone down? Um, the in the just at the edge cave. of the forest. Just at the edge of the forest. Yeah, I'll pop my head out. Oh, I see you. Uh, if you want coal, there's some over in this direction. Okay, that'd be mighty handy because at the moment I'm burning wood. Um, that is a bad idea. I found coal! Awesome. Whereabouts is your crafting table? Have you got it on you or have you got it down? I've not got it on me, it's back in the cave that I was just in. Okay, I'll go and start making myself <laughs> stuff. <laughs> Sorry. That's alright. I think this is quite a good place, even if it's just a starter base for one night. Uh huh. Because it's a nice flat area with a really good wood supply. Yeah. It's kind of where you want to be, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And it helps that although we don't have any um, wool to make a bed, we'll still respawn here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Which is always a bonus. Always. Oh, uh, it's, um, Stephen. Uh huh. We might still be unpeaceful. <laughs> That's a secret, don't tell anybody. <laughs> We're Nobody not on peaceful needs anymore. to know. <laughs> Nobody needs to know. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Might have forgot about that one. I got iron. You've got iron as well. No, I pinched your iron. <laughs> oh, you've got my iron. Where's my crafting bench in that? I picked it up because I was going to come across to you, but I didn't realise oh, okay. you were coming back. Nah, this cave looks promising. Yeah, it does seem to go places. This cave is gone, places. <laughs> right, I got torches. Excellent. Uh, so I'm going to move into some form of relative safety. I think we'll be all right if we're down under underground for a wee bit. It's the best time to come underground because the darkness above the surface means there's more places for mobs to spawn, so caves get quieter. Yep. And that suits me. That suits us very well. Neither of us are particularly good at the whole fighting thing. No. <laughs> Almost as good as we are at parkour. Oh, don't talk to me about parkour. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure one of our other videos shows how, how good we are at that. Yeah, one of our other videos that we didn't finish the map because it was part of Oh, did we not finish that one? We didn't finish that one. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> we probably should have done, but... That was a long time ago now, and in fairness, it was a, it was mostly just a parkour map, so it, it was, was probably a good thing. And it got to the point where it was parkour over lava, <laughs> and that just was endless deaths. <laughs> Not so much fun. I was actually doing quite well, but I think that was because you were on your computer, your old one. 
and you were lagging out so much you thought you'd made it but you were actually only on the first block I know <laughs> <laughs> uh, right okay well this cave actually turns out to be a massive dead end I've got some iron here if you want to come and get it yeah I've got, uh, I've got three bits of iron on me I think okay I think yeah, I've got a load of eight right okay I'm gonna right, take the torches with me as well but it's just another four iron, which is good. You not got a stone pick yet? No, I'm still using my wooden one. Well, I don't know why you want to do that, but okay. Because I don't want to waste resources. Right. Okay, I'm going to make myself my stone picks now. I've more. got your iron, by the way. Oh, that's fine. I've got seven more coming. Cool. Right, so are we going to adventure to see if we can find a different cave? Or do we go down from here? I really don't want to start a mine here. No, me neither, really. Um, I'd rather well, have a mine that we had sort of a, a base built around first. Or maybe even if we had a... Um, well done. If we had one of us going down the mine and the other one of us staying above ground building the base. Yeah. I'd, I'd rather really not mine either. I'd rather explore caves. Oh well, yeah, yeah. I know mining is more efficient, but caves are more fun. Yeah, and if we go um, spelunking... Yes, I love that word. It's so good. It's fantastic, isn't it? <laughs> so fun to say. Spelunking. Um, you actually get more resources and less cobble. Yeah, that's also true. Although at some point it'll probably get to a, a time where we need to go actual mining. Yeah. Oh man, I don't have enough for a chest plate. <laughs> <laughs> I think One we've chart. got more important things to be thinking about than chest plates. Yeah, I know. Uh, bucket. Bucket and shears would be good. Shears? Then we can get beds quicker. Okay, I was going to go for a pick, but shears are good. It's up to you. Uh, iron's fairly easy to find. Yeah, okay. Well, I'm just going to put the rest of it in there. Cool. There's eight pieces in, there in the chest at the moment, so... Cool. We've got enough for another pick anyway, actually, so I'll just make a pick as well while we're at it. Yeah, might as well. So you've got bucket, shears, and a pick. Yeah. Cool. That works should out alright then. Yeah, that should have us sorted for a wee file. Yeah, and we can actually get a, a drop shaft going when we decide that we want to go mining mining. Yeah. Um, I'd quite like to pick up some lava. If we're if we're going to go caving more than uh, um, mining, then I kind of want to build a uh, couple gem. Okay. Ow. Oh, skeleton. Yeah, it's alright, I got him. So much nice. easier now my computer doesn't lag out. <laughs> <laughs> well, considering I was on, what, 12 frames per second last time we played, really? Um, I think last actually you dropped down to about 10 at one point. Yeah. It was a case of, I hope you're enjoying the slideshow. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> In fairness, though, the, the nether still lags out for me for some reason. Does it? Yeah. It's not. I'm not really sure what it is. Not as no. bad as it used to be for me. It used to be awful. Mm. Uh, should we pick up everything and move to another cave? Oh, mini zombie, yeah. mini zombie. Big zombie behind you. That's okay, he's easy there. The mini zombies are just annoying. They're too fast. They are too fast. To the point of insanity. <laughs> oh, did you actually pick everything up? Oh, I haven't got everything. Oh, you haven't got it. No, yeah, that's fine. I'll pick it up. I have a flower. I have an ox eye daisy. Well, that's just fantastic, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's what you want, isn't it? 
I mean, will I, we are set to beat the Ender Dragon. <laughs> this will be our honorary daisy, and we will take it when we beat the Ender Dragon. I would love, like, once to be at, to actually defeat the Ender Dragon and defeat the, wiz wi the wizard. The wizard. I am now French. <laughs> the wizard. Um, the wither and build a monument. I know it would be very nice, wouldn't it, to have like an. I, I quite star. like. I quite like the idea of having a beacon. Oh, that's a, a skeleton. Sorry, uh, okay. A beacon with uh, the <gasps> Ender Dragon egg on top. Have a bow, spider. Yep. There we go. Have bow. Oh, 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 Enderman. Um. Okay. <laughs> Are you wanting to go after the Enderman? Yeah. It is legs. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna it die. It is legs. I shall avenge thee. I don't know where I am. Right? I, <laughs> I killed him. Oh, what's going on? My direction is set. Have you picked up my stuff? Yeah, I'm just going around and getting it all now. Oh, I've got most of the. I've got the coal and the wood. Okay, I've got the iron and stuff. You've got the important stuff. <laughs> yeah. Right, can I get my sword at least? <laughs> yeah, sorry. There's That's your fine. sword. Thank you. Axe. Shears. Bucket. Torches. That'll do you for now, won't it? Yeah, that's fine. Cool. I'm gonna make a notch chapel as well. I'm gonna like go achievement hunting. You're gonna go achievement hunting? Oh, why have I got the Steve skin? I don't know. I've got the Steve skin too, but to me, you've not got the Steve skin. <laughs> Right. Okay. That's weird. Have I got the Steve skin to you? No, you've got your regular skin. Oh, that's this must be a, this, there must be a, a bug. Yeah. Very weird. Uh, I'm going to pick up some chicken and some feathers because chicken and feathers are good. <laughs> um, what do you use feathers for? Arrows. But it's far more efficient to kill skeletons for arrows. Well, chickens don't fight back. This is a fair point, I must admit. I want to know why I only got the cow tipper achievement for the second cow I killed. It has to be two cows. Does it have to be two? Yeah. Oh, okay. The first cow doesn't get you the achievement. It doesn't make any sense, but okay. <laughs> I, so it's supposed to be sort of your cow tipping in the field, is the idea. Oh. Uh, yeah, in case you, you haven't noticed, uh, we've actually got mob griefing off. This is mostly for Stephen's benefit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I go a bit mental with the holes that are left behind. Stephen's OCD benefit, I should say. Yeah, I, I don't like the fact that it doesn't drop enough of the dirt to fill in the hole. Ooh, there's a mountain. There's a mountain? Mm-hmm. Sugarcane. Yep, pick that up. Ooh, there's a kind of cave kind of thing. Found sheep. Would you like to bring so, said shears? Oh, yep, I'm trying to... Right, okay. I thought I saw water. I did see water. You did see water. Right. Where's the sheep? Over this side of the water. Oh, I see them. Snip. Snippity snip. Snip. If you actually want to do it. There we go. Snip. Uh, we've got enough for a bed. For two beds. Two beds. Yep. I was going to say, it looked like that last one dropped about three. There's a tree sheep. A tree. A tree. <laughs> That's a new one on me. Yeah, there's a hole back here that I want to go down. Okie dokie. Because there's a lot of coal. Oh, there is a lot of coal. Hi, zombie. That's not really the way I was going to do it, but okay. <laughs> I'm a, I'll jump in head first kind of guy. Which usually gets me killed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not Fire. my fault. Well, it sort of is. Kind of is, I suppose. <laughs> you know. That was a pointless tunnel. There is literally nothing else in there. Oh, 